and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. My name is Jillian and today I am starting this video off in my car because I'm going to try and do like a shop clean slash decorate with me. So I am sitting out in front of Tuesday morning. I haven't been to the store since probably last year. So I want to run in and see what kind of Christmas decor they have out. I need a centerpiece for my dining room table. And then I wanted something to put on the side of my fireplace as well as maybe some porch decorations. So if I can find anything that is cute and affordable, I will grab it. And then I'm also going to run into Target after I leave here to see if I can find anything over in Target as well. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I don't think I've ever filmed this type of video. I've done like clean and decorates with me and like shopping videos, but I've never like combined it all together. So let me know what you guys think. But I'm going to go ahead and head into Tuesday morning. All right, friends, so in Tuesday morning, I definitely thought I was gonna find a lot more than what I actually found. I'm not sure if this location is about to close down. A lot of the store was completely empty or was like 50 and 60% off. None of the holiday stuff was on sale, but a lot of other things were huge discount, like 50, 60% off. So they might be closing down, I'm not sure. But I did find a few cute things for Christmas. Nothing that was way like crazy over. I unfortunately did not find a centerpiece for my dining room table but I did find a rug for like a mat um for the front of my door that I did pick up and I also picked up two random items that I'm going to share with you guys at the end of this video so look out for what I got like I said I only got three things and yeah I think that like I said they did have a lot of cute options just nothing I was too crazy about so that's why I didn't really pick up much these Christmas trees are really cute but I have enough of them I kind of wish I would have gotten a wreath just because the wreath that I put on my front door my husband ended up breaking so definitely need to go back out to get a wreath but they did have a few options for wreaths that I really like I really liked the flocked frosted look like this and they did have a few different options and also sizes and like I've mentioned before you don't have to use all these wreaths for an actual door you can put it in the center of your dining room table and put like a vase or even a candle in the center of it and I think that's a great way to decorate your house as well well. And now we are in Hobby Lobby. I know you guys are probably thinking, I thought you said you were going to Target. Well, I did go to Target, but I ended up filming a Target Christmas shop with me and also haul. I did already upload that, so I will link it down below just in case you guys missed it. But since I didn't do Target into this video, I decided to run into Hobby Lobby because it was literally right next door to Target. And I'm so glad I went in. They had a ton of really cute Christmas stuff out. If you guys are in need of Christmas decor, definitely run out super fast to your local Hobby Lobby. All of the Christmas decor is 50% off, so you guys can get some really great deals. I only picked up, I think, like two items um because i was kind of in a rush and i couldn't find a centerpiece here as well and i knew if i stood in here too long i would grab a bunch of things that i did not need since everything was 50 percent off but they had a ton of really cute things honestly you guys i didn't even show you guys half of what the store had because it was just way too much so if you guys are interested in me maybe going back to hobby lobby and doing a full shop with me christmas shop with me at hobby lobby and showing you guys more then let me know because like i said there is no way i could squeeze everything they had into this video this video would have been way too long so if that is something you guys are interested in let me know and i can definitely go back out to hobby lobby <music>
All right, guys, I am now back home. And before I jump in to like the cleaning and decorating part, I want to show you guys a few items I picked up. I honestly only picked up like four items. And I know I said I was going to do it in Target as well, but I forgot that today I was also filming a Target shop with me and also haul. So instead of doing it at Target, I did run into Hobby Lobby and I did it over there. So you guys are going to see a little bit of Hobby Lobby and Tuesday morning. They have a lot of really good things out in Hobby Lobby and everything is 50% off. So if you guys are looking for Christmas decor, definitely go run and check out your Hobby Lobby because at least my Hobby Lobby is doing 50% off right now. But from Tuesday morning, this is the only Christmas item that I picked up and it was $10 and it's just a mat for the front of my door. And it says, baby, it's cold outside with a little snowflake. So that's gonna go um, on my front door. And then I picked up two other things from Tuesday morning. They weren't Christmas related, but I'm still gonna show you guys. So you can never have too many masks, right? So I grabbed this pack for my son. He loves dinosaurs. It's a two pack. One of them is Christmas dinosaurs and the other one is just a solid red. And it was only $4.99, so I grabbed some of that. And then for myself, I picked up this pack of masks and they were $10, but the quality feels pretty good. They feel pretty thick and it comes with one solid black one and then two cheetah leopard ones. So I picked up that for myself. And then from Hobby Lobby, like I said, they are having 50% off of all their Christmas decor. So I picked up three things. So you guys know I needed something for the center of my table. I didn't find anything larger or anything that I really liked. So I just picked up like this little mini wreath and I'm going to put it in the center table and I'll probably put like a candle or something in there. And this was $8, but I got it for 50% off. And then I also found this and I thought it was really cute. It's like the galvanized look. And then it also has Merry Christmas in white in the front and maybe i can put some like flowers or something in there and this was five dollars last item i picked up were these galvanized um little houses and it has a bunch of snow on the top and this how much was this this was nine dollars and then it has some christmas trees over here and i think this is really cute so i'll probably put this somewhere in my living room probably my coffee table and then the only other thing i got were some clear pins because i need to hang up my stockings and I was going to put nails, but I would prefer just to use those clear push pins so you guys can't really see it. But yeah, okay, I'm going to go ahead and start cleaning up and decorating the rest of my house and also like my front porch, which is probably just going to be this placemat and also a wreath. But I'm going to go ahead and jump into the next part of this video. All right, so the first thing I am going to do is start straining up my kitchen. This is something I always do. It's like the first area I like to clean up. I'm not sure why, but usually in my cleaning videos, I always clean up my kitchen. So this isn't going to be like any type of like deep cleaning. It's just going to be kind of like a speed, quick, um, tidy up type of video. And then I'm going to start putting out a few more Christmas decor items, things that I purchased today, and then also just my stockings that I have previously bought from Dollar Tree that I never hung up just because I didn't have any nails to hang them. So I'm gonna hang those up as well and then put two little decor items on my porch as well.
guys let me know if you are like me so i seriously sat here for a good five ten minutes trying to figure out how to do this table just because like i said i don't have a large centerpiece so the things i do have are pretty small so i was trying to combine things i was taking things in taking things out i wasn't happy with how it was looking so i ended up just putting the candle with that little mini wreath there but i think it's okay for now i will still go out and look for a larger centerpiece but let me know if you guys are like me you guys keep on playing around with things a million times and now i'm in my living room i'm going to take down those little clear vases that i had the flowers in and put the little christmas trees that i got from target there if you guys missed my target shop with me and haul i did buy that in that video i bought two of these flocked christmas trees that i love i'm so happy i was able to get my hands on and i replaced it for the um faces just because i liked how it looked a little better and then i'm just going to kind of rearrange everything else to the earth it gave great light and so it continued both day and night no So there were some stockings at Target that I really, really liked. I might see if they go on sale once Christmas is over and buy them. Because I think they're like $20 a piece. And I would need to get five of those. So I really don't feel like spending like $100 on stockings. So for now, I'm using Dollar Tree stockings. But they are still super cute. And I am obsessed with them. And then I just bought these wooden letters from Target's dollar spot. And I got the first letter of all of our names to hang it over our stockings. So I got one for everyone in the family, including my puppy maple so everyone has their own little stocking with a cute little wooden letter
right, friends. So this is going to be the end of my Christmas clean shop and decorate with me. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. Like I said, I've never filmed one of these before. This is the first time I ever done it this way. I usually will just do like a shop with me and haul or a decorate slash clean with me. So let me know if you guys enjoyed this type of video and maybe I can start filming them more often for you guys. But I'm going to show you guys a quick overview of the house now that I have put up a few more Christmas items into the house. And I really like the way everything turned out. But I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, please remember to give my video a thumbs up. Also subscribe and turn on your notification bell if you have not already. I would seriously love for you to be a part of my YouTube family and it would mean the world to me. Definitely turn on your notification bell because I have a lot more fun videos coming out soon. I am pre-filming so many videos, so definitely look out for a lot more holiday type videos. I hope you guys have an amazing rest of your day. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time.